Frederick E. Stein, uh, FT3, Fire Control Technician 3rd Class. Once, uh, once that was done and the, the year was up, they said, Fred, come on in. And uh, they sent me over to Brooklyn Receiving Station to wait my orders, and uh, orders came through for the USS Abbott uh, destroyer, and uh, stationed out of Newport, Rhode Island, which at that time was a very large Navy base, very large. Now it's, it's been really scaled down. So it wasn't too far from New Jersey, so I could come home on Liberty weekends. When I walked down the pier with my sea bag and, and, and saw this ship and said, this is my home. For the next two years, this is my home. And um, being it was small, only, like I say, 280 people on board or so, the, the crew was friendly. They, you know, so, of course, there was an initiation time where they, they, they made you do crazy things or they messed up your bunk or something like that. But after we all got to, the, you know, got, got going with one another, uh, they were really good friends. I got to meet, you know, people from down south who really had no education. I got to meet other, you know, officers that were in college. So um, it was a good cross section of people. Nice, nice ship. And then uh, while I was on the ship, of course, uh, I had to start with the scraping and painting, uh, deck gray and haze gray, uh, for about six weeks before uh, the. Uh, uh, I introduced myself to the fire control technician group. They control the, they maintain the radars and computers that control the positioning of the guns. So the gunners mates load them, but the fire control technicians through the radars and directors and computers aim the guns at where they should go. So I was fortunate to get on the fire control technician team and uh, it was a small ship. The, uh, the, the, the Abbott is 377 feet long, 39 feet wide. So you could see two of them would fit on a, on a football field, so, side by side. Um, there was about 270 guys on board, give and take as, as time was, was required. Um, and I spent uh, two and a half years active duty on the USS Abbott. You always felt that someone would always do help you out. You, you know, there you were a close, a close knit crew. Uh, unlike you know, the, you don't know someone up, up front in a carrier and someone in the back. You know, why should I stick my neck out, jump overboard, and you know, try to get them? These guys, any of these guys, after we all got to know one another, would you know, do anything.